Oh, son, don't forget to feed on the chicken. Goodbye. Of course, Dad. I got you always. Mmm. Chicken is really, really good. Oh, no wonder what Dad wants me to feed on it. Hey, son, I'm home. Did you feed the chicken? I didn't hear our chicken today. Did you do something with it? Hey, what? You said on. No, I said the. Feed the chicken. No, I feed the chicken. My gosh, CJ. Grammar and written text are critical components in of learning on how to write. It's important because it presents one strong skills in writing and allows writers to get their message or story to their readers in a clear and understandable way. On the other hand, mechanics specifies the established conventions for words that one may use in documentation. Ooh, I like this bed. This one's kind of stiff. I kind of don't like it as well. Ooh, what is that over there? That that I see. I'll buy that. Say less. <laughs> yeah. Just like what you have seen, buy bed free one night stand. There's no appropriate mechanics written on the text itself. Now for the importance. The importance of mechanics in written text is that the reader or us can easily understand the message conveyed by the writer. We can easily read the written text because we won't get confused where to start, pause, and stop. First, the usage of capitalization is a useful signal for a reader. Yes, it is very, very useful for us because it is used to let the reader know that a sentence is about to begin and show important words in a title signal proper names and official titles. Wait a minute. Man, this pole better not give me a ticket for this one. In the previous situation, punctuation is very important because it makes the written text logical and readable. Moreover, it primarily helps to indicate the process and provide emphasis on certain ideas or thoughts that are discussed in the text. Summarizing, it is used in writing to separate sentences and their elements to clarify meaning. Similarly, just like paragraphing, it enables readers to gather their thoughts after reading the paragraph prior to it. Introduce new topics and link the paragraph together to the topic sentences to create unity. Hey hon, where do you want to go this Sunday mass? kind of want to chill for a bit. Oh, well, there's a sign there. I guess we can go there. Blasphemy! How dare they kill someone! I am not afraid of the devil. Oh, that's where I wanna go. Thirdly, spelling is important because it not only improves our reading ability, but it also builds a learner's knowledge of the alphabetic system. It is used in reading because it enables us, us to learn, discover, and feel the emotion 
or motive that the writer or author wants us to feel behind those words. Amen? Did you see my home run? Bro, that was good! Bro, I saw your home run. Bro, you hit that so hard. Just let, let's wait for the celebratory home run post that they'll do. Oh my gosh, bro. I, I'm congratulating you now. Yeah, bro. Oh, thanks, man. Thanks. Oh, hell no. What is this, bro? This is not how you do a celebratory post. I'm freaking quitting now. I now, with all the situations that you have read or written text, situations that are often mistaken for the right ones, the importance of grammar and mechanics in written text. In conclusion, that grammar and written text are critical components of learning on how to write. It's important because it presents one strong skills in writing and allows writers to get their message or story on their readers in a clear and understandable way. On the other hand, mechanics specifies the established conventions for words that one may use in the conversation. I hope you enjoyed the video that I presented. Sayonara!